one of my main S216 Sengamometers has jammed. Everybody who knows this type of meter knows these have a tendency to jam sometimes. This thing has done 349,000 units, so it's gone around three times, three and a half times around the clock. And the last digit has gone black. So, we need to give it a whack and see if we can get it. Oh, believe it or not, I got a boss two edgy gems. It is, it's just amazing what one sees. Two of these got gems at the same time. How the hell is that possible? It's almost as good as winning the lotto. This is unbelievable. That one is good. That one is gems. And that one is gems. Have a bit better light on here. That's gems and this one. I'll get a clear out of this flaming d uh, doll. And that one still goes properly. Must have got stuck a few times because the email meter is showing 349612 and these meters won't step. Must have jammed up for a while. I haven't taken any readings for a while, so that's quite interesting. Keep you posted. This is a week later and the bloody meter hasn't unjammed itself. The load is 30 ampere. Oh, I'm just going to swap the dial off on this meter. Make it a couple of wax, see if it clicks over. No, it's completely seized. And we look at the other meter. I can see the reading on that one. That rolls over to 350,000. So I need to modify that meter and fix it up. Have a quick look at uh, that one here that's sitting on 77k now. Not quite a bit of power in there. I need to fix this uh, S216. Stay tuned. Here we got the meter jammed. It's freeze it. It doesn't got the Something is not running smooth there. So I'm going to modify it like this, which I've done on the see-through register. I just put an extra dial in there and I make it in a synchro mesh instead of a constant mesh. This is a free floating one, so I'm just going to modify this dial now. This one's one of these weird Senga mode designs, and it has the so-called drop digits, so you always have two tens. But these type of dials can go out of mesh, so um, luckily I can modify it. I've modified some of these in the past too, so. This is actually where the click happens, so yeah. I'm gonna take it apart and uh, see if I can fix it. Uh, let's have a look, I need to get these clips out of here, just little springs. Get another screw out for that. A bit more light. There we go. Take the old light plane out now. Oh, clip on the side too, yeah. Assembly comes out. Spin clip. Take these two numbers off. Here's the counterweight in the thing that's supposed to make the momentum. And you can see the gear wheel here that's three quarters, 270 degree movement. So, and a modification. Okay, well, I just got modest on, and it seems to be running fine. For the bigger service. Uh, the meter dial has been upgraded. That seems to be running fine. 50028. In step with the other meter. That one needs to be done still. That one is still going okay. 
and the modified S2 on a 16 meter. And now we have a look at this one. It should be about the same. Yeah, 350027. Well, one unit difference doesn't matter. Okay. The meters have been repaired. 50079.9. And I'll advance the dials on this thing 14752. Ah, oh, it's this one, yeah. 14752.